We are live, Masuma. Give me one minute. I don't think my backdrop has changed. Can you give me a minute? So you can turn off your video, Zara. Okay, okay. Hi everyone, my name is Masuma Zishan and I'm your moderator for Ed Festival 2021. This is the last session of uh, the, the two day, actually three day Ed Festival. But the third day is of course, one-on-one -on -one appointments for all those interested students who tuned into these 13 university sessions for learning sessions and want to know more. For those who've made up their mind about uh, where they wanna go, or at least are you know, formulating their mind, call us at 0304-111-8020 and our ISEF certified counselors would be more than happy to get you started. This is the last session, but don't go anywhere. Do stay with us till the end because we're introducing a very favorite university, Webster University, and a little bit about Webster. Webster is a favorite to many Pakistani students because of its 120 globally recognized undergrad and postgrad programs, and a huge alumni network. Accredited by Higher Learning Commission, it has three main campuses, St. Louis, Irvine, and Orlando, giving students the convenience to choose their campus. The university offers diversified number of undergrad programs and MBA at both the fall and spring intakes. You can get admitted in the MBA without GRE or GMAT. Yes, you heard that right. You do not need a GRE or GMAT, and you can be fresh out of university. Webster is home to more than 10 Fortune 500 companies offering jobs and internships. It is also ranked as number 60 in best value schools, where the source is from US News 2021. Welcome Zara Lagari, who is the business development manager of Webster University. Welcome again, Zara. And if you can just get us started. <laughs> Hello, Assalamu alaikum, everyone. So I'm just going to quickly going to brief you guys about Webster University and we're open to feedback and questions and answers after that. So feel free to pour in your questions after that. Okay. So this is Webster University USA, more than 100 years of inspired education. It's a private not-for-profit university which was founded in 1950. And it has made, when we talk about the details, I'm going to speak in detail as well. So we have about 120 globally recognized undergraduate and graduate programs. Student to faculty ratio is something you really and must speak about is 12 is to one, which means students are not just sitting in a large classroom with their faculty teaching them and going back to their notes. They're being taught by professionals who have expertise in this field who are in entrepreneurship. It has several start dates because we have rolling admission due to COVID, you know, we're open, we're open in terms of application deadlines as of now as well. And it's accredited by High Learning Commission. So St. Louis coming back to, as I said, we discussed St. Louis in detail. St. Louis is home to more than 10 Fortune 500 companies offering jobs and internships. Now, when we talk about the location, location is definitely students need to keep in mind. Irvin and Orlando is also, uh, you know, students' favorites because generally what happens is when Pakistani students travel abroad, mostly they have relatives. So if they don't have it in Florida, they have it in St. Louis. They don't have it in Irvin, they have it in Orlando. So if they have family nearby, it's easier for them to stay with them or on campus and commute to campus as well. Also, I would like to add one more very interesting feature here. So last year, LinkedIn did a survey that was in 2020, which mentioned that St. Louis itself is the first place where students were landing with their first job. So it wasn't just New York, San Francisco, Boston, or LA, it was St. Louis. So keeping in mind, it's a hub to more than 500 Fortune companies offering jobs and internships opens up more gateway for students. 
we have on campus housing available to international students we definitely advise undergraduate students because they're younger in age um, you know sometimes they don't have the expertise to go ahead and be independent from the first year so we encourage them and advise them to stay on campus however for postgraduate students it's up to them they can stay on campus or look out for their accommodation it's completely their choice rankings we must speak about this 50 Midwest and 60 in best value. They can definitely head as they're very, very handy and accredited. Admission requirements are pretty much more or less simple schools require these details so for english yes english requirement is there in terms of either ielts pearson password test toefl or duolingo what we mean by that is the students can take either one of these exams and enroll with us there's a signed application form the process is very simple it's very straightforward of course letter of recommendation certificate of finances proving that you'd be able to support yourself or your parents or relatives, whoever is your sponsor is there to support you. Application fee details and the application process. So we have a handy team who is going to be a very hands-on, very practical, it's a very holistic approach. So the first thing is going to be applying, that's the application process. We're going to guide you step-by-step. Step. Secondly, once you've completed your admissions process, we're also going to help you with mock interviews. After you've completed those, we have a hands-on team at the university. So when students are traveling back and forth or traveling to a new city, we have teams who would be taking care of them in terms of airport arrivals and departures. Looking at the graduate scholarships, it's something very interesting for Pakistani students, of course. CGPA, if it's above 3.5, there's a straight 20% discount, which is amazing. So the tuition fee cuts down. If it's below 15%, you know, then again, it's a good amount for sure, because even if you have slightly lower CGPA, you're still getting a 15% discount. Moving on to this video, I would just like you guys to have some feedback from this video and go through it. The management and leadership program has helped me to understand and balance the difference between management and leadership. In my profession, the next level would be a chief of police. This degree will help me accomplish that. The first class was overwhelming. I didn't think I'd be able to accomplish it. I went to the professor the first class and I said to him, I can't do this. There's no way I can do this. And he talked me into staying and I'm glad I did. The professors were able to give you one-on-one -on -one opportunities and answer questions and help us individually if we needed it. They were able to give real life explanations and real life examples of what we might run into in, a, in an everyday situation. I never thought I'd enjoy going back to school, but I have really enjoyed the classes I've attended, the people that I've met, professors that I've had. It's been a positive, fun experience for me. Thank you so much, guys. I'm just going to stop this here. And we're open to feedback. Masuma, over to you. Yes, uh, Zara, thank you so much for uh, giving us this uh, beautiful intro about Webster University. And again, the visuals and the video are a breath of fresh air. They're so refreshing. Uh, and I'm so sure the students enjoyed it as well. So currently we do not have any questions uh, on our Facebook Live as well as the chat, which means it could mean two things, right? That your presentation was so to the point and uh, you've covered all the elements and also maybe that the students have reviewed all the university sessions uh, from yesterday and today and they're making up their mind. Okay, so I would, good news. Yes. <laughs> yes, good news. So thank you so much, Zara, for uh, being there for the larger part of the day and for this session as well. Uh, thank you to the team, Gas, and I'm just going to be doing a quick sign off on behalf of Etsyam and Gas for all the participants who viewed in on our Ed Festival 2021 sessions. 
do write back to us, give us feedback about uh, the Ed Festival. Also share, uh, you know, any apprehensions, any concerns, queries that you have about university applications, call us at 0304-111-8020, and we'll be more than happy to get you started on your study abroad journey. And of course, I'd like to wish everybody a very, very blessed Eid. Eid Mubarak, everyone, and Khuda Hafiz. Eid Mubarak, guys. Take care. Bye.